2099 here again with another video now this is a review but since it's Tuesday I decided to do a mock let's go take a look at him and here is Megatron now this is Megatron based off of Transformers Prime but I'm going to be saying this I did take some liberties instead of purple I use red because that looks a little more menacing and this is before he uses dark energy so after maybe he just the purple comes from the dark Energon, but um, I don't know if you haven't seen the TV show, you're like, what is that stuff? Oops. Yeah. So let's just get into some scale. Here he is with a minifig. It's not that great, but it's okay. Here he is with the Jurassic World dinosaur. So basically, he's up to that first stud. Megatron's a stud. No, I'm just kidding. So let's get into the transformation of this guy. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna fold down this leg. There's a hinge there. Bend it down. And then take these cheese slopes or slant pieces. I don't know, what do you call them? Tell me in the comment section below. Then you swerve them up. So it's like that. So it kind of gives him a flat foot. And the second verse basically the same. Hold it down. Slant. And you got some legs, except this is the wrong way, so you're gonna have to rotate it. And then bring down the arms, just like so. So there's a ball joint there. Bring it down. Now there is a little bit of parts forming. To take this part, put it right on there. Take this part, and put it back on there. And then, for full scariness, bring up the head. Anyway, he does look pretty nice. Uh, if you can't tell, that's red. Dark red. Um, so he has dark red there, dark red on his shoulders, dark red under his chest. He has some, trans, uh, some translucent piece for a little effect for his fusion cannon. And his little head has some light piping. On the back, he does have normal red and gunmetal, but that's fine. You never really like to look at your figures from the back. Articulation-wise, he has one at the shoulder, one at the elbow, well, elbow, one at the wrist, hand. Oh my god, he's so cute. I'm just, I'm sorry. He has a hinge for the fusion cannon, so he can fold it back and kind of have it underslinged to look pretty cool. And then head to move up and down so you can be like, look at your bad guy. Oh, no. <laughs> he has a little outward. He has a spool here. A ankle bend thing. So you can be like, ah, damn it, you broke me. He has a bend. And yes. Oh. Oopsie daisy. So yes. That is Megatron. Now, to s if he can stand up, he doesn't want to stand up, stand up since the camera's on. Okay, since he's standing up now, let's compare him with the dinosaur. Haha, <laughs> you suck, he's bigger. I'm talking to the dinosaur, not you guys. You guys are awesome. If you haven't already, you could be even more awesome if you subscribe. Here he is with a minifig. Please don't kill me, sir. And then we'll do one last comparison with his future self. <gasps> Galvatron. Voyager Galvatron from Trans Return. So yeah, that's how he scales. Um, I think he is the size of a legend. One second. Let's get Legend Wheelie over here. Oh, he's taller than a legend. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. Here he is with just Christmas tree R2 D2. I felt like it. And so yes, that is Megatron. My mock of Megatron. Now, this Megatron I figure is being more of the direct one, like the one who will go up to Optimus and shoot him. Instead of like planning a way for all his Decepticons to destroy Optimus. 
this is definitely going to appear in maybe some future stop motion if you want some. Um, I may do some Lego Transformer ones. Sorry, my camera's shaking. I was trying to stop it. Um, anyway, he is pretty good. I mean, color-wise, if you're going to try and build him, you could switch out the red for purple. Um, don't know if they have translucent purple, though. Well, you could use studs, but it looks better if it's just a tile piece. But whatever you guys want to do. If you build this guy, tell me in the comments. But you should subscribe if you're going to build him. Um, anyway, thanks for taking a look at my second review. It's a mock. Um, I may do more mocks in the future, and they may do... Well, I have a whole bin full of Transformers. Um, Lego Transformers. Uh, and if you want me to, uh, give this video a like, and subscribe if you're new here. Anyway, bye guys! Haha, -ha, I shall rule the world as the Earth's new Decepticon leader! Haha, <laughs> I was reviewed first! Spoiler alert, you die, I become you! Haha! <laughs> This is just becoming the worst day ever. Goodbye, guys. Make sure to like, share. You don't really have to share. I just legally have to say it. Nah, I'm just kidding. Uh, you can't share this with some of your friends who, or people you think make good LEGO Transformers. Make sure to subscribe and comment below. Of what do you think I should review next? Should I review my Star Wars base? Should I review another Transformer? Should I review a LEGO Transformer? You guys tell me. And uh, if you think about it, you should give this video a like. Anyway, bye!